Hi, welcome to Lockdown Lads. I'm Nick Ead, and we are going to be with a great panel of uh, guests. I'm going to introduce them now. These We've are got... people that, that are in a state of panic and trauma, and then the Prime Minister is going, stay in, but go out, and stay in, and go out, but you can go where you maybe can. And people are walking away from it going, going, what did he just say? <laughs> but I tell you one thing, here in Los Angeles, least he's not telling people to, to go, go for the disinfectant. Well, that's true. Very, very true. If I was um, Boris for a date, I think I'd go on Amazon, Andy, and I would actually order a comb for Boris. Oh, <laughs> I would do. It's the only thing I'd do. <laughs> to, to try to tap into some of the things, I've explored some of the things that Max has said over the years, had my own journeys and own thoughts on things. Um, but I have to say, that time to think about those things has to be parked in lieu of a huge leap of faith that the fears that you're feeling are just going to be all right somehow and to try and focus and it takes a huge leap of faith to, faith to focus on the positives that i mentioned earlier that actually might come good from this situation so i've been staying away from the news i've been i've been dabbing in and dabbing out because when this started um, the first person that I text was Nick E. And he said to me, Andy, calm down. You're going colossal. This is what you do. You're a risk, babe. Andy Newton Lee, always a risk. Correct, my friend. Um, yes, mate. Guinness. Oh, I love that. My, my wonderful wife can pour a Guinness from home. I love that. Oh, my God. Hi, Kimberly. <laughs> uh, in fact, this is pretty really weird, Max. What we should have done, you and I should have done this. Did, no, go back. Go back. Put it back. And then I'll do this. Wait. Here we go. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we could do this. Yes. <laughs> There's the commercial. <laughs> There's the commercial.